Hey, Mr. President, what are you planning to do with all that money? Mr. President, did you know that women account for two-thirds of the illiterate people in the world? What are you planning to do with all that money, Mr. President? Why don't you support women's rights? Mr. President! Nice, isn't it? A good army, Mr. President, is a symbol of power. If you want to be respected, you must invest in a good army, Mr. President, just like all other countries do. No, Mr. President, you don't need to. Like all countries do, it just costs several billion. Respect, power, maybe even a little invasion? Oh my god, we need help. Who is going to save my bank? And mine. I cannot even pay my bonus this year. Mr. President, Mr. President, you must help us. It's your duty. Yes, it's your duty. Otherwise, you'll put the whole system in danger. Yes, the whole system. In danger. It will be your fault. It's your duty to save our banks. Hey, Mr. President. Did you know that 17.5 million women are currently living with HIV. Did you know that in Sub-Saharan Africa, three out of four of young people living with the virus are female? Please? Use some of your money to address women's rights. It's your duty to save our banks. But you have a lot of money there. Can you give us some billions? Yes. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank you for saving this system. Mr. President, welcome in a world of fashion, entertainment, and glamour. <laughs> oh la la. I see you got some money to invest in happiness and good life. <laughs> we have what you need. Please, come. Hey, Mr. President. Come. How are you going to spend the money? Oh, hey. What oh, a noisy right. people. They may also need entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mr. President, let's have a look here. Where can you spend your money? Football? Or maybe a new fleet of cars. What about a new jet? Oh, big and beautiful place where you can stay far away from that noisy people. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with it. Everyone uses the public money. It's free. And maybe next year you won't be president anymore. And maybe next year you won't be president anymore.